Join the fandom menace and execute your own Order 66 with our incredible line of t-shirts, Soy Low, A Soy Wars Story, Tico, A Soy Wars Story, and our brand new smoking hot Soy Wars Plan 9. Make a statement today. This is the only trilogy you'll ever need. The link is below in the description. Hello. Hey, what? All right. Okay. All right. Welcome to Comic Artist Pro Secrets. You are listening to Ethan Van Skyver, 25-year veteran of this comic book industry. This one right here, uh, the one that's trying to be a bad influence on its big brother right now. Let's have a look at this story from Fox News, uh, the most trusted name in news. Uh, Marvel reportedly trying to convince Disney to bring back Axed. Guardians director James Gunn. And here he is right here. This is Axed Guardians director James Gunn uh, with this haunted kind of smirk. He's seen things that uh, no uh, sane human adult uh, should see, uh, could bear to see. He's seen it. And this is the smirk of a man who's holding it all right in here. Uh, look at this. See, the thing about uh, this kind of a, a guy is that I'll tell you something. If I had hair like him, I'd comb it. Hey, uh, James, James Gunn, uh, if I had hair like yours, I'd be combing it. I, you could call me James Comey if I were you. I'd be combing that hair. Uh, take it for granted. You took for granted your job uh, at Disney. Uh, you took, you take your hairline for granted. It's a good hairline. Well, you know, comb that hair. Uh, James Gunn was directed. Uh, James Gunn was set to direct the third installment, third uh, of Guardians of the Galaxy, before Disney fired him over offensive tweets. Can't we just leave it at two? Why, did, why does everything have to be a trilogy? It sounds like. Why is everything? What's with the number three? Three. A pyramid. Three. It sounds very uh, Illuminati. It sounds very much like Freemasonry uh, there. Who can we ask about that? Let's send that over to Mark Dice and see what he uh, has to say about Hollywood and the number three. Marvel is reportedly hoping that Disney executives will consider bringing back recently fired guards. Hey, good news, Marvel. They did recently consider it. They recently considered it. They took him into their office. They had a nice meeting with him, and they quickly threw him out. and They and they hired a couple priests to come in and and uh, bless and sanctify the room because, uh, yeah, they decided no. Uh, they, but so they did consider. They did consider it. They did. Uh, citing sources, which sources? Disney reported that quote back channel conversations are taking place between Marvel Studios and Disney regarding bringing Gun back. For the upcoming Guardians 3. Uh, Gunn was axed. Uh, I wish that were true. When some past tweets resurfaced in which he joked about rape and pedophilia. Ha 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 ha. But he was different. He was younger then. He was only in his mid-40s when he was... Now he's grown up. You know how kids are. You know how kids are edgy boys. You understand. Gunn, who was set to direct uh, the third installment. Third Number three of the popular superhero science fiction franchise was fired on July 20th. Walt Disney uh, the Studios chairman Alan Horn told Fox News that the studio had, quote, severed our business relationship. Uh, but some are seemingly still in the embattled filmmaker's corner. You bet there are. You bet there are some people uh, who are still in this guy's corner. Of course there are. Uh, we see it all around us. Marvel's contingent is trying to persuade Disney to explore a compromise. Hey, here's a compromise. Uh, we'll stop driving you nuts, and you hire the guy uh, who has a history of saying extremely disturbing things. You rehire the guy uh, who has uh, interacted with child pornographers, connected, uh, uh, convicted uh, child pornographers. Uh, you rehire the guy uh, who has uh, written essays about how he thinks it's wonderful when children are sexually humiliated by animals, uh, and then a wealth of other stuff that's going to emerge about this guy. Rehire him. Uh, rehire him, and we'll stop bothering you. Rehire him, and we'll stop bothering you on the interwebs. That's that's a deal. That's a compromise, uh, Disney's Mike Fleming wrote. Disney did not immediately respond for a request for comment. Disney, do you want to comment? Can you just... Disney's like, look, can you, can you just get the... Uh, that's Disney right now. Um, look at these two pictures here. Uh, the kindness, the angelic warmth, uh, the grandmotherly love of Roseanne Barr versus the cynical evil. Look at the calculating evil. Look at these eyes. Chin down, eyes looking up. Anime villain trope. Uh, yeah. Yeah. 
He won't even button the top button on his tie. He won't comb his hair. Uh, yeah. Sinister. Kind. Loving. Uh, earlier this week, The Hollywood Reporter noted Wednesday... This is... I hate to point out, Fox News. Fox News. I don't want to... I don't always want to have to point out garbage to your writing, but I will. Uh, earlier this week is vague. It's nice and vague. Uh, you don't have to put noted Wednesday. That is super specific. So this doesn't make any sense. you got redundancy here. Earlier this week, the Hollywood Reporter noted Wednesday uh, that the company plans uh, to use the script. Earlier this week, the Hollywood Reporter noted Wednesday, <clears throat> nope, redundant, that the company plans to use the script he wrote for Guardians of the Galaxy Volume Three. Well, I would, uh, I would go through it very carefully. I would go through it very carefully for sinister and weird, creepy subject matter. I would. I'd be very, very careful. Um, Deadline noted. Uh, oh wait, multiple sources told uh, the Hollywood Reporter the gun is stuck in complicated negotiations with Disney over his exit settlement. In other words, uh, they've got all kinds of uh, mathematicians. Uh, because physics are involved with his exit settlement, how much counterweight should they put on the other end of the trebuchet to fling him from Los Angeles to the Bermuda Triangle? It's a lot. It's a lot of weight. So we want to get it right. We don't want him to end up somewhere in Atlanta, Georgia. Uh, we do want him to go all the way uh, across uh, the country. Uh, it is going to be a, it's a complicated negotiation. All right. Um, yeah. Disney's uh, plan to use the script is playing a role in that. Uh, they're going to use his script as a counterweight as well. All right, good. Uh, Deadline noted that Gunn is returning to direct the film, uh, or, or noted that Gunn returning to direct the film would be a long shot. It will be. It'll be um, about 8,000 miles. Let me just see. How how long is... Uh, it's not 8,000 miles, is it? How many miles, many miles from Los Angeles to the... Bermuda Triangle. Luckily, I have a lot of different iPads here so we can figure this out. How many miles? And let's figure out what uh, what they say. Uh, all right, so, oh, it's not that many at all. It's not 8,000. I'm way wrong. Uh, it's it's 2,881 miles, okay? So uh, this, is, this is the um, long shot that they're talking about here. Uh, 2,881 miles. Straight shot. Whoosh, boom. Arc for the wind. You got to imagine the wind, also the curvature of the earth. Sorry, flat earthers. Sorry, uh, there's the curvature right there. Okay, so from here to here, 2,881 miles. So that is uh, that is the complicated negotiation uh, that Disney is involved with in right now. Um, yeah, it's a long shot, but the community is talking about it. Good, good. Any any help I can provide, let me know. Uh, I'm here at Comic Artist Pro Secrets 24/7. He was swiftly fired. Look at all of this. I love all this trebuchet speak by Disney last month when past tweets were unearthed by critics. Critics. They call it's not like they're like the same as movie critics. Uh, we're critics. We're, we're being kind of critical of your obsession with pedophilia. You know, uh, you're not doing it right. Uh, Internet gumshoes uh, discovered guns feed included offensive remarks, offensive remarks regarding sex with minors. No, not gold miners. Not not like the miners from the 1800s. Not not coal miners. Miners, underage children, rape, jokes about the attacks of September 11, 2001, AIDS, and the Holocaust. So all of those hilarious subjects. Uh, one of the now deleted tweets says, uh, "Yeah, you read that. I'm not reading it." Uh, another message said, uh, "Read uh, blah 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 blah." Uh, no. Uh, Gunn apologized for the years-old tweets. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for the years-old old tweets. Uh, please don't look any further. Uh, please don't look any further. Um, I have regretted them for many years since, not just because they were stupid, not at all funny, uh, wildly insensitive, certainly not provocative like I'd hoped. No, they were. They were, they were provocative. They were provocative. But also because they don't reflect the person I am today or have been for some time. Uh, he's grown. He was in his mid-40s, uh, 10 years later. You know, he's matured. He's finally, he's matured. Uh, that's great. Um, yeah, regardless of how much time had passed. Uh, now listen to this, SJWs, listen carefully. Uh, I understand and accept the business, business decisions, SJWs, not artistic decisions. 
I'm sorry, not political decisions. I know that this hurts you. Business decisions taken today, even these many years later, I take full responsibility for the way I conducted myself then. So let him do that. Uh, these people uh, who are his friends refuse to believe what is right in front of their eyes, uh, all signed an open letter addressing the issue and called for Gunn to be reinstated as the film's director. Uh, yeah, not a great idea, guys. Uh, Disney already said no uh, at this point. Uh, if Marvel continues to coerce them uh, and badger them, uh, and abuse them. Well, you know, I mean, more stuff is going to come out uh, for, you know, for example, I mean, there's no end to, this is the thing. We've only just scratched the surface. Here's a set of photographs I found uh, from his account. There is, uh, again, you know, I'm sorry, I told your kids to not be here. Uh, here is this, uh, this dude, James Gunn here, uh, pretending to be a pedophile priest. And he is, uh, He's got his friends pretending to be abused children. Ha 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 ha. It's really funny drinking a, ju a juice box at a doll, crying uh, because he is abusing them. Look at this look on his face here. Uh, here's another one. Uh, priest, he's got, we've got a clown choking a woman dressed like a child. Ha ha, she's sucking her thumb. And I don't get this. Uh, is he supposed to be a girl too? I don't really know. Uh, but uh, yeah, ha ha ha, pedophilia. Uh, it is funny. Um, party, uh, down in a wooden basement, whatever this is, who knows. Uh, more stuff like this is going to pop up, and I'll tell you something, middle America isn't going to like this, people who normally uh, take their kids to see Disney movies, uh, this this just isn't funny, it's disgusting, uh, there is more of this uh, that will emerge, lots more, uh, I saw a video clip of him um, abusing a woman on the set of one of his movies, and talking about doing bad things to his own daughter, uh, that kind of stuff will, will resurface and uh, it, it will make Disney's, uh, if Disney changes their mind uh, and, and decides to bring him back, it will make Disney's decision to do so painful. Uh, that's it. I mean, just uh, stick to your guns, uh, Disney. Get this guy out of here, away from you. Uh, don't listen to Marvel. Marvel Comics, they're a bad influence. You just look at what Marvel Comics is doing to its own company, its own characters, its own brand, and ask yourself, is that what you want from Mickey Mouse? Uh, is that what you want? Is that what Annette Funicello would want you to do? Uh, I don't think so. Hey, want to follow me on Twitter? Okay, cool. I'm at Ethan Van Skyver. Talk to you there. If you enjoyed this video and want to become part of this community, subscribe to this channel by clicking the Laughing Man Face logo right on your screen. Ring the bell for notifications as well. You'll never miss a live chat. And stay tuned, another video by Comic Artist Pro Secrets is coming right up.